about four minutes from getting underway here. It sure is good to have the uh, jazz band back here. And uh, the student section as well. Uh, so post-COVID protocols are uh, making it a much more exciting basketball game here at the ship. And we've got about four minutes for game time. Kicks off, so we'll be joining you then.
for tonight's Class 2 a showdown between the visiting Latin Panthers and your Dale Pirates. First for the Lady Panthers, coming into the ninth game, right number three, Class 2 in the World Basketball. From the 11, that's our Jamie Lewis. From the 14, that's our Jamie Lewis. From the 16, that's our Jamie Lewis. Got Faith Wright jumping. Gets the big 6-3 Latta girl. It's going to be an interesting matchup tonight, uh, especially coming off that loss. I'll interested to see how the recovery goes. Got a little bit fuller roster today. Got an injury coming back on for the roster with Drew Shirey. Balls up, and Latta controls it. Bring it down against, uh, looks like a man. Somewhat of a zone. zone. Yeah, it looks like a one through one. Excuse me. You're right. Faith right running the back, and looks like Brooklyn on the top, running the top. Good movement by the girls. Long skip pass and a three by Latta. No good. And out of bounds. Dale's ball. Again, a top five showdown coming into the night. Latta's number three. Dale's number five. Anxious to see how the Lady Pirates bounce back again after that loss to Ampo that we feel like we. Probably should have, could have won. Yeah, that was a tough loss there. They look like they, uh, oh, nice handoff and a drive by Brooklyn. So Down the lane and a foul right out of the gate. Number 11, Jaylee Willis. That'll be her first and Latta's team first as well. Shooting two. First one's good. Oh, in and out for no score. Second one up, and same thing, in and out. Other way, still scoreless here with um, almost 30 seconds gone. Nice little press, tip ball, out of bounds, and it's going to be Dale. Got to start making those easy ones count. Yeah, can't afford that. Um, it's been kind of a early season problem with most of the Dale games. I watched the uh, junior high yesterday, and they were two for 17. Uh, eighth and ninth grade girls. So uh, it's been systemic a little bit early in this year. I think we'll uh, we'll get it under control later. Yeah, just one of those things that comes with time. Yeah. So a lot is in a man to man and not super ball movement by Dale. There's a nice pass to the weak side up against the big girl, drives against her over to Faith for the three. Off the back of the iron. Looks like out on Latta, gonna be Dale's ball. Dale basketball, yep. Dale basketball in front of the ladder bench. 6.42 to go in the first. We're still scoreless. Herman over to Rutland. Rutland, Rutland inside the faith right. Ooh. Yeah. Picks it back out to Rutland. Kind of a sloppy pass. Three groups. Gil to Herman. We're making some good cuts in there. Uh, getting oh some gosh, open up here. She did a double. Yep. Just uh, she, she saw what she thought was a pass. Hesitated and then uh, got a turnover on that one. Some nice cuts. Some open looks. Uh, just got to 
crisp up the passing and finish him up. Yep. So it looks like a little three-quarter court press, press here. Yeah. Off the foot Good of Lada by Kenzie and Gill. And back and forth. Turnover by Lada. The uh, Good hustle by McKenzie Gill. Very good hustle. Lada with two turnovers early. Actually, Lady Powers get those jitters out. It seems like we're still kind of having those first game jitters. Yeah. Kenzie no, Gill's three's a on nice the way looking. off the back of the iron. It was a good looking shot though. I'd say both of the shots, I hopefully they'll gain some confidence in uh, those looks. Both of them have been very, very close. All right, that's Brooke Rutland's foul. First on her and first for Dale as well. Back into the press. Just don't want to get beat on this press because they do have the high advantage. Yep, they certainly do. They're probably going to try to break it in the middle with the uh, big, tall girls. Um, oh, good hands court, good ball. hands. Seems he's got a hand on the ball. Gives us time to recover into defense. Back into a looks like a little two-three zone. They're not even looking at her. Good job, Addie. Addie getting better on the front baseline. Into the, the short corner, turn. up to the top. Can't handle it. Ball loose. Scramble. And Faith comes up with it over to Brooklyn. Like to see Brooklyn down the right side. Right here. And goes for the layup. Uh, no, no call. Oh, there's a call. Late call. Uh, I think we're going to get a foul out of that. I think that's on number 11, Jaylee Willis. That's her second. Latta's second as well. She has all Latta's fouls. That's a big one. She's the one that kind of hurt us last year against Latta here. Yep. Let him in. Brooklyn's got it nailed in now. Knocks it down. Oh, is it touch screen? I guess so. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I like to see Brooks sink that one. Shake off these jitters. We got to get rolling. Second, Second one. one's good. Nothing but net. 2 0 Dale. 537 to go on the first. Lady Pirates in their full court press. Ooh. She kind of carried it there. Yeah, she did. Uh, big long pass down the sideline to the big girl. She holds it up. We which lets us recover into defense. Ooh, Back in that extended that. zone, and we're very aggressive on the zone. Oh, yeah. they get it into the big girl, though, for an easy bucket. So 2-2, two, two, 5-18 to go on the first. Lady Pirate ball. Kenzie Herman surveys the floor. I see Eddie Bell. She got called for a moving screen last week. So you get those feet set. Kenzie Gill's three on the way. Off the front of the rim. we got to get those. Those are wide open. So, Latta basketball. Brooklyn Ryan will bring it up the court. They're trying to look inside. They yeah, really they're, are. They're swinging uh, quickly to try to get an open nice look inside. Good. Kinsey Gill has been in every passing lane so far. She drives down the middle. Doesn't like it. Pulls up over to Kinsey out of faith for a three. Ooh, it's off. Yeah. Tough to the right. Rebound by three. We're getting the looks we want. We just got to convert on a couple of them. I agree with that. And our defense has been more impressive than what I was thinking it might be, but we have been really handsy. Faith did, tried, tried to come in for a backside hand on that ball, but no success. That's what we're gonna have to watch out for, those loops over the top. Those girls are very tall back there. Very, very tall. Brooke Rutland's three's on the way off to the right. We're getting wide open looks, just gotta hit a couple of them. Four minutes to go. We're halfway through the first quarter. 4-2, Latta. Let's see if Back. the Lady Pirates have somewhat of an answer for... Offensive. Oh, yeah. She she gave her the elbow she, hook little, there. Yeah, the little. Oh. Trying to push her back. That was uh, thir 31 against, uh, I think... Taryn Batterton. That's Latta's third and her Ken first person. Kinsey Gill, right, is who she was pushing was, backwards. Yeah. So and into the game for the first time this season is Justice Shirey, our senior, number 12. I'd like to see Ju get involved a little bit here. See so get first. Oh. Takes a look at it, drives out. McKenzie's Kinsey. three's on the way. Good. 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 Three-point basket for McKenzie Gill. Makes it 5-4, your Lady Pirates. Back into their press. Long half-court pass. I'd like to see those half-court passes be long because they're – It really slows, slows them down like and gives them a tra them. trapping opportunity. Oh. Oh, big wide throw over the pass, top. Yeah. yeah. That girl, uh, Taryn, is committed to play softball at Grand Canyon University. Well, that was a certainly a softball the, yep. throw for sure. Yep. <laughs> it was, could have been first base. She'd have got her. She, she would have been out from <laughs> the outfield for sure. Uh, over to Kinsey Gill. Nice screen by Ju Shirey. Back to Ju. Looking at it. Driving. Nothing there. 
Back over to Faith on the right side. Over to Ken, uh, McKenzie. Back out to Juice Harry at top. Drives it, kicks out to Kinsey Gill. Kinsey drives it. Goes up, nothing there. Uh, Gets blocked and recovered by Latta, unfortunately. Now, Latta, not yeah. as deep as they were last year. They lost some key parts, like just like the Lady Pirates did. They do bring back the two bigs, though. Yeah, and that's uh, tough to drive in. you got to get underneath them, not uh, be tough to go over top of them. Uh-oh, blocking call on Brooklyn. Brooklyn second. That's her second foul. Yeah. She's going to have to be smart because we're going to have to have her on the floor tonight. That's kind of with those open threes. We've got to hit those that kind of expand their, make them respect it a little bit. Yeah. Too shyry in the middle of this one three. It looks like almost like a three two, and then it is. It's like a man zone sort yeah. of. Yeah. It has the man concepts, but oh, oh, big over the top pass. Brooklyn almost got a hand on it and didn't. Oh, oh, oh. I think we're looking Kenzie at Gilgard in the ball. Still on the ball. Doing a good job of killing that ball way out there. Big girl up top lobs it to the underneath. Ah, gets the bucket and the foul. Unfortunately. I don't know where that foul came from now. I think he's going to call it on Herman. No, oh. Faith Wright must have grabbed her hand from the front or something. I didn't see that one happening. But It'll be her first and Dale's third as a team. To the line for Latta's Taryn Batterton. She'll go for the old-fashioned three-point play. And it's Ooh. off the front of the rim. As I say, the ball don't lie. <laughs> I don't think it's a foul either, ball. Rebounded by McKenzie Gill out to Kinsey Herman. Mm. Oh, excuse me. McKenzie Herman. Rebounded by McKenzie Herman out to Kinsey Gill. Where did you Shirey in the corner? Drive oh. across. Tough pass. Oh. This, this is Jew's first game. I expect to see some of that here and there, but we got to sharpen up. First quarter jitters, which is what we're going to call them. 6 5 Latta with 158 to go in the first. This is a top five matchup. Number three Latta versus number five Dale. Another good there pass. We go. A bad pass. That, me. that uh, those hands in the passing lanes and that press is really getting to him to and that's make those long, whole, difficult passes. Yes. And that's what the whole idea is to speed them up. Yeah, they would love to play this game at super slow speed with those two bigs because I've been watching how they run down the court and right. they're not nearly as quick as we are. No, we got to get running. That's the quick key. I know we're going to be tired, but we're going to get in shape tonight. We're going to have to give it all. Three-pointer from Jews on the way. It's off the Short. front of the rim. Rebounded by a 31. Oh, Brooklyn out with the foul. Yeah. So I'd like to see us rebound and go. That's what we're going to have to. That's where we've had success in the past two or three years. And a lot of basketball. Batterton looks inside. One on pass. Oh, Kenzie Gill may get it and go get a layup. Oh. Decided not to. Juchieri at the free throw line. Bumps it around, out of bounds on Latta, Dale's ball. Right. One minute to go in the first quarter, 6-5 Latta. We do, I did expect a low scoring game, I will say that. I think that'll help us, honestly. Yes. Our yes. offense has been... Uh, it's shaky. Yeah, I mean, it's, they're still having to work working out our kinks. offense a little bit. Brook Rutland in the lane. It's good. Nice. Two-point basket for Brooklyn Rutland. Oh, don't pick up a foul. Don't pick up a foul. Brooke does have two fouls. Oh, let's see her go get that. Latta has a starter with two on the floor as well. Jaylee Willis. Long skip pass. Brooklyn Rutland. Another like skip pass. Drives in. Out to the corner for a three-point. Latta makes it. That's Chloe Miller, three-point basket. Maybe Lady Pirate Ball. 25 seconds to go in the first. 9-7. Brooklyn driving. Oh. Loses the control of it. 20 seconds to go. Burke's got to be smart here. Kinsey's got her stopped at the top. She just loops it over there to space, and a lot of girl goes and gets it. Watch the corner over here. It's coming. We've definitely gotten a little bit slower on defense. Oh, we got rebounded over top of him. Oh, no. I think McKenzie Herman picks up a foul right before. Yes, I don't get how that's a does. foul on her when she, she had the block out. I'll give her that. So it'll be a foul on Mackenzie Herman. Batters into the line. No, it's uh, no time on the clock right now. 
She'll be out there by herself. First free throw is good. Well, the crowd wasn't very happy about it either. No, I'll tell you that. Should have got going. Second one's good as well. So Lada will Got get two points with no one on the floor. 11 to 7 Lada at the end of one. Be Dale basketball to start the second. Again, the top five matchup. Number three Lada, number five Dale. A much anticipated game. I like how our Lady Pirates we open up with number two Ampo and then turn around the next we can play number three Lada. <laughs> It's no a rest for the weary. It's a front-loaded schedule. It uh, is, it, and that usually works well in our favor. I think this year with we've had a lot of roster changes with injuries and stuff, and I think uh, it's going to take the Lady Pirates a little while to get their feet. It over. will, and you know, Coach Smith will always have our girls ready to go when it counts. Yep. So here we go. Start of the second quarter. Uh, your Lady Pirates are down 7-11. They uh, are bringing the ball out. So Dale basketball to start the second, down 11-7. Look to see our offense get going. Missed about five three-pointers in that quarter that were wide open. So hopefully those will start falling, getting a groove. Over to Brooke in the corner, right corner. Play, kind of playing a, almost a five-out rotational through the middle, to keep them honest. Kinsey driving, uh, no good. Gets a foul, though. Yeah, it's a foul on number 31. 31, that'll be her second, right? That's her second. Salada has two girls with two fouls. And they're not very deep in the tall girls category. Uh, once you get past their five, they're kind of like us. Kind of not slouches off, but I mean, there's just, I don't know what you call it. We don't have any hot to spare, though. Right. <laughs> Kinsey puts in her first. So Lattice fourth, Batterton second. And we got a sub. Ava Bell in for Brooklyn. No, excuse me. Addy. Oh, Gracie. Gracie came in. Gracie Waller. And uh, Addie Bell came in as well for Jew, it looks like. So, double sub. Second ah. one's off to the Gotta side, unfortunately. Rebound by Lada, bringing the ball down slow and steady. Makes three for six at the free throw line so yeah. far. A lot of pressure up top by Kinsey Herman. And McKenzie Gill out to the corner. Three-point shot, no good. Rebounded by Lada. Turned around. Good spun. job there nothing, by Gracie Nothing Miller. there. Gracie did a great job of just standing straight, not letting her have anything easy. Ball out of bounds. Dale's basketball. And that's what we've got to have, kind of a lakey presence around the rim just to kind of contest some of those. You know, those two girls are a head taller than everybody else. Right. Kind of contest those. Like to see Lady Pirates. Herman brings the ball down. Looks like a little 3-2 set up. Over to Faith. Tipped. Recovered by Lada. And driven back down. Brought skip pass to the right. Taken down the middle by 14 over to the corner. Back up to the top. Short. Lady Pirates are getting their hands everywhere. Yeah, they are. They rotate. And I think it's really keeping them from seeing the short corner. That short corner has to come way out there. See how far 31 is out? Yes. She's almost in a three-point extended. That should be a short corner right in there on the block where she could hit it. But because the Lady Pirates are getting in the Ooh. passing lane so well. Ooh, Kinsey almost got it. Almost got a walk, too. 31 for the three and drains it. Oh, my. Yeah, we've got a wasn't they do drive right. them. We've got to kind of contest them and try to draw some charges as well. It's something that's going to have to work for us. We've got to hit some open shots, though, and free throws as well. Coming with the ball over to the... Right side to Gracie. Gracie Waller over to Ava. Ava over to Kinsey. Kinsey That's back Addie. to Gracie. Addie, Addie Bell. Addie. Excuse me. Thank you. They're I playing a real sunk in two three. Yeah. They're just kind of daring us to shoot that extended three. Yeah, we're not really. We're kind of playing into their favor right now. Yeah, we are. We're, we're unconfident with it. We need to. I think we need to take it at them a little bit. They're calling some touch fouls if, if you get in there. I like to see us move the ball quicker. That's what's now they're up. extended out into a man-to-man. -man. We got them coming out now. There we go. Faith tries to drive it and catches the foul. I think. Oh no! Oh no! Addie Bell picked up. Oh my goodness! Addie Bell picked up a illegal screen. I guess I, I guess don't know what that was. She was moving away from her, but. Uh, 
Picks so up her first. 14-8, 5-27 to go in the second quarter. Don't want to leave her wide open, but don't want to. Drive to the corner into the short corner, passing. Oh, good cut. job and there. And there you go, as That's you were talking our about. Third foul. You just mentioned how we need to take some charges. No. And it'll be three on their leading scorer. She Faith, has 11 of the 14. Faith Wright, the senior, steps up and gets one for us. Maybe the swing the Lady Pirates need because she does have 11 of their 14 points, but she also has three fouls in the second quarter. Yeah, I think that'll help us out a lot. We're going to have to get a little momentum swing. Him. We're kind of playing sloppy, sharpen some things up. For sure. Well, we'll see what we do with uh, the big girl out of there. We're right at him with a three-point. In and out. Good job there Rebounded by Faith. She's ready to go. Over to Gracie in the corner for the three. Uh, off the back side of the rim, rebounded by oh. Lada, and then a push foul by Kinsey Gill, I think. Yes, Kinsey Gill gets her first, I believe. But puts them in the bonus. So after this, they'll be shooting one and ones. Back into the press for the Lady Pirates. See how they do without the big girl to help them out. To get Look at a trap on the on corners. The oh, we. Faded out of that quickly. I felt like we. Brooke can't get hurt third though. Big Good. long pass over the top. Nobody there. See, Dale's ball. We're getting turnovers. We just got to convert on somehow find something. I mean, I don't know. I agree with you. We're still. I, I like I said. This a lot of roster changes. A lot of different rotations. A lot of different looks but for girls. Uh, new roles, like you said. Uh, we're just going to have to figure out where our offense yeah, is going to come from and how we're going to do it. I think that that's what they're in the that's what the beginning stages of the season are for. Right, I agree. And uh, they're still looking at nice rollout by Brooklyn and a good pass up and over and good for two. Good shot there by Brooklyn. Nice pick and roll. It really was. It was a really nice pass by Herman into her. A lot of comes back down. I'd like to see us get another turnover and or stop close yep. this four point gap. Drew Shirey came back in at some point for Addie Bell. She's playing in the middle of this zone. Probably to keep her mobility down a little bit. Hands up, pull up, no good. Nice Rebounded by Latta, unfortunately, and put in for an easy two. Mackenzie's blocking out, too. I don't know what else she can do. Yeah. 16-10, Latta. Drew Shirey over to Faith. Faith, Faith taking a look. Way off the front of the, front of the rim. Oh, tapped by Herman, but not recovered. And Latta picks it up. Big girl in the middle with the ball. Latta pulls up. 16-10 Latta with 3.25 to go in the second. 32 brings it around for a three. Look, and it's good. Oh, my. We're giving them wide open looks. They're hitting or not. That's the difference in the ball game right now. But Herman brings it down the middle over to Brooklyn on the right side. Back to Gill up top. Takes a look at it. Doesn't like it. Uh, kind of hung up now. Over to Drew Shirey in the corner. Back over to Gill, to Herman. Herman up top, looking to reset everything. Gets it where she wants it, starts the offense off. I'd like to see us move the ball quick. We're kind of just playing into that zone again. Yeah. Jeez. Let him have a little sunk down piece. Two Shirey up top over to Faith for the three. Uh, off the back iron, She's rebounded by Latta. Latta up to the big girl. The big girl's getting worn out. She's running very slow. Timeout by Latta. Two thirty left in the second quarter. It is nineteen ten Latta leading the Lady Pirates at this point. Lady Pirates seem to we're 0 for I'm like, I think I'm kind of 0 for 11 from the three point line. Yeah, but defensively, I think they're doing all that they can against yeah, this team. They really are. Score a little bit. Yeah, we've got to get the offense moving for sure. And Coach Smith won't put up for that with that for long. He's uh, he's very offensively minded. I think he'll get something. He's trying different things. He had kind of a one four looking offense out there and. We got a nice little pick and roll off of Brooke. Yeah. Some Morley on the camera for us. Doing a great job down there. 
worried about it, but uh, if you're seeing the picture, it's her doing. We're just sitting up here talking about it. <laughs> Coming out, 30 second timeout, 2.36 left in the second period. Lattice ball at the half. Brings it down into the zone. Moving it across that two guard. Pull up jumper, no good. Rebounded by Brooklyn. Gotta get this is where we want, right here. Yeah, and she's pushing hard. In transition. Over to Faith. Faith. Faith cuts it back to the middle up to Kinsey Gill. Kinsey Gill takes a look at the three. In and out. Faith uh, rebound almost. Over to Brooklyn. Brooklyn gets a little bump, but no good. Rebounded by Latta. I'd like to see us press that point guard out there a little bit. She drives down the right oh, side and then walks. That's definitely a turnover. I think the high speed helped us out on that. We got two really decent looks at the ball, All at right. the goal right there. Sooner or later, those those will drop in for us. So I think we're getting the looks. That's definitely better to do that than Brooklyn that. for the three. Oh, that one went, bounced in. Friendly roll. 19-13. <laughs> so. Galata into the press. Long pass. Back to the middle with the big sure girl. Brooke doesn't pick up her third before half. Resets it. To the left side corner. Faith out there. Big skip pass to the other corner. I'd like to see us read that on the back side of that zone. Kind of yeah. take a chance and get it going another way. We were a little aggressive, a bit more aggressive at that in the first quarter. I think uh, we're seeing some wear down. Oh, good hustle by Brooklyn. Tapped the ball twice. Yeah, it's definitely out of bounds. Oh, excuse me. Back court. Half court violation. She got control of it on this side of the court and then dribbled yeah. over. This is a stop we need, you know, get some more points yeah, before one, the half. Yeah, 112 before the half, 13-19. Pick up a couple of twos or threes right here. Going to the half, feeling pretty confident. Herman up top over to Faith Wright. Faith the Jew. Big swing over to Herman. Herman takes a look, drives. Doesn't like it. Good pass. Brooklyn. Oh, oh, man, almost got the almost got to put in two. That was a great dump by Herman over to Brooklyn. Brooklyn picks up the foul on 14, her first. Brooklyn shot the majority of our free throw, so hopefully she's got zoned in, but not on the first one. See, let's get this one. Close the gap just a little more. Five, 59 seconds left to go. Addie Bell coming in for the shooter. Brooklyn. I think he's going to get her out to make sure she can get that third. Yeah, smart move with only with less than a minute left in the half. And she picks up the second one. 19-14. So we'll see Addie Bell on the back of the press. Too shy moving up to the I'd like to see us get a stop somewhere. A bad pass. Nice little trap move right there, making some back it up. Stays with the trap, ooh, to the middle, unfortunately, and breaks the press. But nobody home for a fast break. Ooh. Thought she was going to get there. Kinsey Gillis. Good. Yeah, Faith go. did. Faith gets a nice pick, drives down the right side. A little stutter step. Kinsey Gill gets the rebound, looks to go back up. Gets kind of mauled in the loose ball. Out of bounds on Latta, Dale's ball. 31 seconds to go to a half, 14-19. In favor of Latta. That turned out a lot better than it could have for sure. That scrambling down there. We got a score here. If we score here, I'm gonna feel a lot more confident going into halftime. Inbound to Addy, over to Gill. Go back to Herman. Herman reverses back. In, oh, tries to back into Addy, but tipped by Latta. Dale's ball. 21 seconds left in the half. Herman inbounding. Over to Drew Shirey. Drew back I to see Herman. McKenzie take her man, and yeah. there you Ooh, go. Nice drive down the baseline, reverse. Uh -huh. Oh, not quite in. Stays with it, though. Keeps it live. Everybody diving on it. Oh, Lada comes up with it. So nine seconds. Nine seconds left. Eight. Down the sideline. Crosses over. Gets all the way to the bucket and picks up the foul yeah. on Drew Shirey. Yeah, she wasn't quite set yet. Not what we wanted to see going into half, but three seconds left. 1914, Latta. Choose first foul. Lady Pirates seven. And Latta Panthers six fouls for the half. 
First one's good. Second, second one in no and out. Good. Rebounded by Faith. One second left. Big long pat. Um, no good. And halftime score is 20 to 14 in favor of the visitors. It's going to be 10 minutes, and we'll be back with the second half action.
All right. 50 seconds left in half time, and we're about to get started. Third quarter will be coming out. 14 20. A lot of Panthers leading the Bad Boys Pirates. Heavy ladders ball to start the second half of play. Yep. Switch sides. Maybe the other side will be a little hotter for us on the three point. Who knows? It's been nice to have the student section and the band back, though. I will say that. It is. The jazz band is something you need to Dale, and you haven't seen that hardly anywhere else in high school basketball anymore. Hawaiian day today, if you guys see the student section over there, they're all in there. Blue Owl shirts and plays. Lada brings it in. Coming back again. Freshman five. Lada has a foul trouble. Number one has three. I believe the left one has two. Test the ball, but they're going to give Faith the foul on that one and push foul. Two ticky tick. Her second, I believe. Yes. Dale's first in the second half. 22 16. Not inbounds it. To the top. Kins of Gill pressure is good. Kins are five seconds, and Dale's ball. Turn it over there for the Lady Pirates. Need a lot of this yeah. half to kind of make a comeback and start getting some of the shots and get early on. I tell you what, Kinsley Gill's top line defense has been excellent. It, when she's not tired, she tires tires out uh, a little bit through the quarter though, and you'll see. But I think Faith for the three. Oh, oh. kind of off the front iron and did no good. But We're gonna have Faith stepping up, senior and leader. Yeah. Long pass by 11 over 14 back around the top. Swung that back to 11. That's the problem, too, though. They got McKinsey Gill and Brooklyn running a lot of ground up there on the top. Nice drive and no finish. Oh, oh contested. Uh, coming up by Lada with the rebound over to 32 with the three. No good. Walk there, Maddie Bell. Yeah, it was. McKinsey Gill picked up the rebound off the front over, drives it coast to coast, doesn't like it. Uh -huh. Leaves it right in the 31's hands, unfortunately. Who, who is trailing? Yeah. Out. Getting some stops. Yep. Lada's playing very, very disciplined. Oh, right into the short corner. Nice pass. Too easy for that two. That's the unfortunate thing about this defense is when uh, 31 can kind of see over the top of our defensive passing lanes and pop it into the court. Nice pull up by Brooklyn. They're good. Herman rebounded it back to Brooklyn off of her hip and Lada recovers it. Throws it out to 14. That was. And drop back down the floor. 14 ladder. To the high post. Back down the corner. Drives it. Steps around. And makes the two. 26 16. Ladder. Herman brings it down over to Brooklyn, back out to Gill. The top, Gill pulls up for a two. Long two, no good. Off the front of the eye, rebounded by Lada. A lot back down the right side. Pushes hard. Defense, Addie Bell gets there. Zero step around. Shot, no good. Off Faith right hands. Out of bounds, Lada ball. Two shy reach up there for Herman. 
can you hear me? Inbound by Lana, up to the top. Gill uh, almost gets there, misses the ball, put on a play. Over the corner for three, and it's good. 29 to 15, Lana. Inbound to Brooklyn. Looking over to Kyrie. Looking at the long three. <laughs> that was a long three. Corey Gill, go back to Brooklyn, drives it, forces it, and puts it in. My goodness gracious, that was quite the shot. Up and under, big number 31. A lot of brings back down. 29-18, a lot of. Gives up top pressure over the right side. Skip pass, over 14. Takes a look at it, doesn't like it back to the top. She resets it. I don't like that dribble of hers. I think a little bit of pressure will get her to double that. Drives it. Two oh, shot Oh, wow. I thought that was a clean block and called it out of bounds, but he's going to call a foul on Two Shirey. Her second. Dale's second and a half. And 14 will go to line, 2 2. It's the first one. Gracie Waller and Kinsey Herman coming in for Kinsey Gill and Addie Bell. Second shot. Up and good. Herman bringing the ball down. Up against the big girl, over to Gracie Waller, back at the Brooklyn, Brooklyn over to Dushiri. Dushiri is the guard, it drives around, over to that face right, face right tries to drive Zimmel, nothing there. Over to Herman in the top, back to Dushiri, face at the top, and kind of a reset there. Over to Gracie on the right side, back to Brooklyn, Brooklyn with the drive, back out to Gracie for a long three, and no good. We got the Bilata, out the right side, held up, long pass forward. Skip pass across, I thought Faith was going to pick that off, but she held up. Long skip pass to 11 for a three-point. No good. Rebounded by Lattice, 31. Puts it back. No good. Rebounded by 24. Put it back. And a foul on top of it. Brooklyn Rutland, fourth foul. Third foul. Ooh, goodness, it was only a third foul. Worried about that one. Yeah, that was way too many sh second shots. I'm sure that Coach Smith is talking about that. First time we've seen it all day, though, honestly. She's getting a little bit flustered and tired, I think. Extra points, good. Keith Herman brings the ball down. Ooh, Faith Wright trip. And then another trip, which got the key. <laughs> a walk call that doesn't get called. But uh, a lot of brings the ball on up. Drives it down the right side, kicks it out far for the three, and it's good. Lada Panthers lead by 19. Herman over to Dushiri. Dushiri with the reverse. Uh, balls loose, knocked around, and then recovered by Lada. Passed over, touched by Brooklyn. Down the right side by Lada to the middle zero. Outside, 31, takes the long shot. No good. Rebounded by Lada. We're not even going out for rebounds at this point. We've got a rebound. That was an uncontested rebounding there by Lada. Um, two girls standing to the side. Thank goodness she fell down and walked with it. Herman bringing the ball up. Over to Gill with a long three off the front iron. I doubt we will against this height. I mean, I would imagine we, we give one look at it. We've done a good job of not giving them second looks until it's last down. Big three. And it goes in. My goodness gracious. Lada is on fire. We're getting threes from everybody at this point. Herman brings it down. Pulls up for the three. Off the bat, rebounded by Gill, brought back out from two, off the glass and in for two. 40-20, 
Back into the press. Broke by the middle. Timeout by Lowry. Third and second timeout by Lada Coach. 40 20. Lada Panthers retail. Still looking with their feet on offensively, for sure. Yeah, we've got to have our seniors step up a little bit. I mean, this team is going to be late, late, and we're going to have some productions in there. But it is so early, though. It's a good thing. Yeah. This ball out of bounds to half-court. Inbound. This is the right side. They, they pulled 31 out. Looks like they're going to be her rest. Playing still that extended zone. Skip pass. Big skip pass. Hand off. <laughs> bobbly, bobbly between the ladder players, but figure it out. Another big skip pass. One-handed skip pass. I don't like those. We really have to keep picking those off. This is another sloppy pass that gets finally recovered and re-centered by Alada for the top. Oh, she's terrified of Kinsey Gills at the defense. Gets it out of there, out to the three-point line, shoots it no good, rebounded by Faith Wright. Oh, he gets a foul. 14. Sticks the fingers in there and punches the ball out, but also punches Faith Wright. Her second foul. <laughs> To see us get something golden, go with golden. It'd be nice if we could be golden, but uh, still trailing by 20, 25 seconds to go in the third. And Gill surveys the floor. Looks like we're going to hold it for one shot. Playing a little bit of a zone. Like a man zone out on Drew Shirey. She moves it out to Gracie in the corner. Gracie's killed the ball. One second left. Shot by Herman. No good. Well, that's another thing. Coach Smith, I mean, I don't think he minds getting beat, but we've got to get beat for going 100%, you know. I don't think we are right now. Got two checking in, Brooklyn and Eddie Bell. See if they can uh, help get some energy out there on the floor. We're going to need a little bit. Dale's ball coming out in the fourth. Trailing by 20. I'd like to see the Lady Pirates kind of regroup here and end on a high note. Yeah, it'd be good. They got their starting five back out there. A lot of dust. And so did the Lady Pirates. Screened by Addie Bale, but it looked like a trip. Herman still got the ball, struggling for it. Looks like a jump ball for this ball. The loudest ball. Yeah, nothing really going on the Lady Pirates way, let's be honest. I mean, it's just uh, <laughs> It is a little bit sloppy today. Something I do like this defense is in the zone defense he's got. That top, those top guards are really working hard. Kinsey Gill is out there in everybody's grill. Oh my gosh. That was a terrible pass. The girl just happens to be 400 foot tall and catches it. And then misses it. Uh, they get the rebound, but unfortunately, uh, they get a block. A block call on him. Looks like Herman. a little line block action here. We just lob it into the block. She turns, shoots, and scores. 
Herman brings the ball down. Here we go. Go off that as well. Out of the Herman. Up to Brooklyn. Brooklyn drives, nothing happening. Here we go. Drive for the left out of Addy over Herman. Hand off to Brooklyn. Brooklyn drives, reverses, puts it up, nothing. Two downs, puts it up oh. again, still nothing. Ooh, at Faith Wright gets in there and ties the ball up. That was just nice. That one. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, shoot, I'll give you a 20. Big gum. <laughs> Those are two dudes that looks at it, and both of them just kind of sliding around the run here. Uh, Dale's ball on the tie up. Will inbound it. Confusion going on there. Tipped it back out of bounds by Lavish. It's like a one four cross now, reset. Crossing screen. In the inbounds to Brooklyn on the three. Over to Gill. Back over to Addy Bell. Addy's up to Herman. Clears and back up to Brooklyn. Brooklyn drives to the right side. Puts it up into the backboard. Rebounded by Lavish. Five down the middle. Passes it to the right. Holds up, back in the middle. Brooklyn gets a hand on it. 31's got a dead ball. And then back in the middle. Yeah, nice little shuffle pass. Missed by 24, rebounded by Faith. Nice, nice rebound. Drives it coast to coast. And gets the two plus one. See how we get... I don't know. We got to get, find a way to get things in transition. We're in transition. We're pretty daggum quick and we, we score. Yep. And got an extra shot at it. So I, I agree. The transition ball is uh, going to have to come along. Us. And that just means we're going to have to get in better shape. Yeah. I, mean, I know we don't have numbers. I mean, that's no secret. Yeah. He's uh, doing a good job rotating. He's got, uh, he just put in another one. Um, that's a Lyle Landry. Lyle Landry, thank you. And the one is no good. Almost rebounded by Lyle. So we're just going to have to push hard all game. I think the girls are used to being able to uh, push hard for a little yeah, while. Yeah, let's just. But, oh, my. <laughs> Looks like a tie ball by uh, Gill, but it's called for foul. So her second person. And two fifth. Inbound. That's an half court. Gill's going to stay on it. Oh, no. Long pass to the right side, stepped out of bounds. Oh, no. Offensive foul by 24. Over the screen with the pin. Dale's ball inbound to Herman. 5.42 left, still trailing by 20. 22.42. Steele tries to drive, turns around, pulls up, gets blocked, and Lateral covers it. Running down the middle is a big girl, 33, and scores in transition. Dale right back at him, though. Herman pushing hard off the right side. Pulls up over to Faith. Faith with a wide open three and makes it good. Her first points of the game, I think. No, shit. Back into the press, a little half court press here. Three quarters. I can see us close the gap a little closer. I mean, it's, we just haven't had a best of luck shooting tonight, and that's where. Right. Well, that's what it takes. Uh, yep. A little bit of, a little bit of transition, like you said, a little transition. Got us a wide look at that green. Yeah. Yeah. Oh my! Two Shires going to pick up a foul on two four. Hard to stop them in there. Once they get it the ball is, in yeah. there, there's not a lot. We and can our do. rotations are kind of lagging too tonight. If we were to stop them. And the bottom line. The back iron. Two fourth and have another go at it. Trinity. Put the second one in. So it's a 20 point game again. You can't see me pull away from that. No, we can't. We can't close the gap. It's going to stay at home. You can't see the other Herman sets it into the half court offense, drives down the right side, picks up the foul. Oh, oh no. Picks up the charge. 32 did a good job of setting her feet. I don't think 31 was set. 
32 did a good job of setting the feet. Gladys ball, inbound, man-to-man -man press. Inbound to 14, goes all over. And gets an offensive foul from it. Good job. 14 throws an elbow to try to clear some space. And Gill sells it a little bit. Tails ball. Still a 20 point game, four and a half to go in the fourth quarter. Oh my. Getting a little ticket tap now. A bit. Oh man, that's Drew Shirey's fourth foul. She's on the ball, 32. Girls are in a man to man now. Drive and kick by Lada, mm. and nothing happening there. Tied up by McKenzie Gill. Yeah, good job. Good job. Seven to go in the fourth. Had a bell in for Drew Shirey. Again, we knew coming in we were going to have some big shoes to fill. Losing Elaine Witt, Anna Hester, Dannon Lane, Maya Miller, all those good ones. Yep. Amy Ottoman. I'm sure I'm missing some, but that's, that's yeah. five bodies of <laughs> Five bodies. I mean, it was a large roster shift this year. There you go. Uh, and we're still working. I appreciate the girls are really working hard right now, though. They are. Oh, that's a little easy in, and the girl misses it. 31 misses it. Landreth rebounds it over to Herman. And the girls haven't really quit. They're working hard still at it. Nice drive by Herman. Puts it up, and just nothing dropping for us, really. Mm -hmm. Rebounded by Lada. And the credit to her, I mean, around the basket, you've got almost all three shot. I mean, they're tall as well. Probably absolutely, absolutely. She's she's really drifting that ball way up there. Come on. But again, you know, we're just gonna have to some of those things you just gotta have to play with what you got and yep. perfect what you can do. Turn it up to Gill. Gill looks to drive to the left side. Does gets the basket and the block. Nicely done. 32 didn't quite get her feet set that time. She got over there, but yeah. She got over She's trying it. I won't give her that. She's, it was close. Closer than I would like to see him, but uh, she, did, she was still moving a little bit. They're using that big girl to kind of guide us down one side of the lane, and 32 comes in to try to pick up a I'm in and out. I'm just, uh, it's been a bad, it's been, a bad <laughs> it's been a bad start to the year. I know that Coach Smith is not happy about what he's seen. Out of the girls' basketball at the beginning this year. No, and he just got to, I mean, I've seen a team win it with six girls in the last one. You just got to get in better condition, you know. Yep. Shoot when you're tired. Drive by 14 and charge. Oh, he picks up the charge by Faith Wright. Faith Wright does a good job of getting down low, seven feet, and picking up the charge. I think that's 14 is fifth. That's fifth. Final thought of the game. She'll end it with five points. Into the game for Lattice, number three, Alicia Trader. Inbound to Herman. Herman bringing it down. Over to Gill. The bell screams. Picks and rolls, nothing there. Back up to Herman to the top. Turns it over to Addy. He looks to drive the middle, pull up, jumper, no good. Rebounds. Off to Herman. Herman now to Gill. Gill with a wide open three. No good. Oh, oh. Fifth right. right's down. Maybe a cramp. Definitely a cramp. They're trying to stretch it out right now. Well, that didn't look good going down. No, it didn't. It didn't. I had a weird angle at the, and I was like, she, oh. she kind of, she kind of slapped her leg a little bit, and uh, I was worried there for a second too. But then I saw her trying to pull her. Well, her legs kind of got like a bend. You see it was. I go, oh. She was trying to pull her toe back, so it's definitely a cramp or maybe a little, a little bit of a sprain. But I'm thinking she cramped up, or maybe got Charlie horse. 
Timeout by Dale. And we have a shooter for Faith. Again, Lady Pirates have a lot to work with before we get where we want to be. But um, good thing is, it's only the second game in. Uh, the ceiling's somewhat there. Yeah, but we're all going to shoot the ball for Faith. Hey. Maybe cut it down to a 16 for the game. That'd be all right. Free throw did count. Um, there's a regulation about how fast you can go back in. I think it's going to be a 30 second off the clock or something, so she'll have to wait for the ball. Anyway, ladder brings down to the down low and gets an easy two. Mm. Dale pushing hard right back at him. 47 29, ladder right now. Flip to the right side. Over to Addie Bell. Addie to Gill. Go over to Brooke for the three. No good. Gets her own rebound. Up. Lobs it up to Herman. Herman with a long two and See, knocks it like down. That's what we're missing tonight. You know, you know, the hustle plays, you know, all claps and applause. And Back into the man-to-man. -man. And a little ticky tack foul by Herman. I mean, a little, little ticky tack foul. But, you know. She double-handed. Uh, yeah. And I think that's really what he's looking for. Yeah, you, need, you need two hands. Down. You need two hands down. Any coach plays against his hands for that hand check. Right. Right. Back in the game, it's 23 Faith right. Let us see Faith back in. 47-31, cut it to 16. One and one for number three. You see us get a rebound. He had a good some. block out right here. She knocks down the first one. Put the two bigs back. That's interesting. Well, I guess the foul trouble. Maybe I don't know if I can think of. Let's see I get going. Personally, I think watching them run, I think they're tired. Yeah. You know, they just don't want to run the court. Over to Gill on the left hand side. In the middle for Faith at top. Up to Brooklyn on the right side. Spin move. Up. <sighs> almost in. Almost. I'm telling you, she is this close. We are this close to becoming a, a little bit a little bit better every yeah. game. We'll tell you this is it's gonna be one of those games, you know, you're not gonna have the Yep. And it's gonna be it just matters how you're doing at the end. Puts the first one in. So here you go, like fourth quarter. No quit. Still driving hard at the goal. Uh, almost creeping him in. Puts a second down. Making it a 15 point ball game. Excuse me. Still a 16 point ball game. Back in the press. Ooh, oh, double dribble. Go. And just the turnover. Faith Wright gave her a little scare. Right. Got her to double tap. Bill's ball out of bounds. Herman will bring it in. I'm good to see the girls not giving up here. And that's what I'm saying. And, and you see some real bright rays of hope. You do. Yeah. For the future. I know that we got off to a real slow start. It's impossible to come, overcome a slow start against the number three team yeah. in 2A. Uh, you're just not going to see a lot of that. But Gill for the step back. No good. Brooklyn rebounds it. Back out to Faith over to Brooklyn. Back to Herman. Herman to Gill. Gill drives it. Pulls it back. Three again. And it's good, good that time. Yep. But like I said, you're not going to recover, I guess, a number three, 218. But we have seen some recovery. We do, yeah. And that's one of those and things. We're starting to see some scoring and some understanding of how it's been scored. And the girls are starting to play hard. 
you come to say, you know, I'm not saying it's a down year, but I mean, we don't. There's no secret. We don't have the. We lost two all staters. Yeah. yeah. We don't have the horses we did, but I mean, that's just a. That's a lot for the younger kids to get some experience and go for the future. And I watched. By the way, I watched the nice game the other day. Ooh, bright hope, bright hope. Man. They were scrappers. They were out there playing hard. Uh, beginning to end, I really liked what I saw. So, and I, I like what I've seen in the subs, the sophomores, and everybody out there today. Like I said, uh, at the end of the game here, we're still playing hard. We're actually decreasing the lead for Lada. So yeah. we're starting to see. And that's the thing. Like when we have to run the floor to beat teams that are bigger than us. Yes. That's the that's the bottom line. That's the question. You know, this is. We have played number two and three back to back. So, I mean, we hope to see a little bit of a comeback here. Yeah, this is great learning and great film and great understanding for the future of what we're going to need to do this year. Uh, back in the band to man press, and got a good shot. At, uh, there's a turnover right see, there. And there. Another, you know, we're just kinda Losing 14 really hurt it from a ball handling right. perspective. And we got to just keep that up front pressure going. Yeah. One minute 14 left, your daily Pirates trail by 13 only at this point. I can see us close the gap a little more, get some more stops. And a lot of man to man. Lob to face right. Big hit on Gill, big double hit on Gill. Faith goes up, gets blocked, and rebounded by Lada. Lada looking to draw, bring it up. Gets it, gets it to the half quarter and will probably try to keep it extended out. Gale back in the man to man. Tip. Gill picks it up. Tip by Herman. Gill picks it up. Drives the court. Pull up shot. Block. Tipped away. Ladder rebounded. Outlets to three. Reese kind of standing there and then puts it forward. Tip, oh. Lucky tip to 24 over to 31 and an easy two. Faith back down with her calf, I believe. Up and moving now. Definitely having some cramping problems. 21 seconds left in the fourth. Herman puts up a prayer. In interesting shot. <laughs> it is a prayer. <laughs> I think she was stuck with nowhere to go. Kind of threw it up there. And now we're going to start to see some stuff. Stay right out. Get that calf under control. Yeah. Get a little bit of fluid in her. And Dale back in the main. 15 seconds left. Cross court to 10. Sim drives it forward. Over to three. Three back to 10. Way up to half court. Looks like they're just going to run it out. Yeah. Andrew gets a hand on it. So the game. final score, Lada Lady Panthers 51, Dell Lady Pirates 36. Lady Pirates fall to 0 and 2. Lady Panthers improved to 3 and 0. We will be back for the boys game. I said that kind of lost on the yeah. what is going on there. Really don't, I lost it there for a second. <laughs> uh, remember, if you are watching at home, you have to reload Dale Pirates TV to get the boys game back. So we'll see you back then in probably about seven minutes.